my yeah. question is what would go better prefer i would prefer with the uh, operations sir mm. i am from engineering background sir so which will be better sir for oh, engineering you have to equip yourself on the operations if you uh, because as we have seen in the slides if you have that interest towards efficiency and output definitely you have to take operations but operations combining with marketing is what i would suggest because any a, any profile combining with the marketing and business development is highly recommended because uh, not only marketing and sales e, even any profile be it hr or finance you have to meet the client face the client uh do the stakeholder management all that is a part of your profile which is not projected outside okay so client facing is something by default you have to handle with the external people for which your marketing business development those kind of elective will help you to understand the basics okay marketing doesn't mean you have to go like uh, you know what you call this uh, eureka eureka forbes guy where they, where you have to go and uh, sell door to door that's not marketing and sales okay marketing is is highly enterprise sales where you have to network with people build a relationship show your products and then sell that's the process not the not the one which you are seeing a sales person uh, when we are going in a train or bus or sales person person who's uh, knocking our door that is not sales they 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 that are all like local sales which doesn't belong to an mba category kind of level here we are talking about enterprise sales business development where it is at a higher level okay where you do not have daily targets monthly targets and all that it will be more like 3 months 6 months one year kind of thing okay targets will be there but 3 months 6 months that's the kind of cycle which you will have to evaluate uh, wherein you will have to work on this that should be my suggestion combining operations and marketing should be the right perspective so i have a question sir so can we have hr in finance as a specialization is it good sir hr and finance are mutually exclusive okay no way it is related to uh, each one because uh, finance is completely more into analytics numbers and lot of work towards uh, those kind of things where hr is more into people management uh, those kind of aspects hiring recruitment see both the common element in both is you will have to play with numbers excel sheet on a daily basis but it's a complete a different domain based on your characteristics okay so finance needs a lot of mental work and uh, tough competition in the market because the preference will be given to icwa and ca in a finance uh, uh, unit in a particular manufacturing company or any company for but hr is something where uh, with your characteristics with your enthusiasm with your communication skills you can go into any industry and perform and then execute things that would be my suggestion but i don't suggest taking finance and hr it's completely mutually exclusive i would say does it make sense yes of course it is no i have a question sir now we in every company uh, they are using ai for recruiting and everything so what will be the actual role of hr will ai replace hrs completely or will we still have a chance to any automation tool will be a supporting tool for the real time people only so uh, hr is the only area where no automation can be taken place because for recruiting you have to judge their uh, personal characteristics which no other ai or automation tools can help. okay any which way you have to call understand the people how he will fit into the culture you know all that you have to assess manually and then process it but this automation tools can help you in preparing your dashboards pipeline for the month how many people have recruited that kind of analytics support the automation can help but purely uh, your personal characteristics communication skill communication with the other departments is highly required for an organization without communication with finance or marketing how will you recruit people for them okay so inter communication between the units and hiring externally processing them working on their salary mediclaim insurance and the highly uh, major aspect is employee engagement uh, in an organization where you have to engage people okay for that you will have to interact with people make them happy you know all that so that they they can be retained in an organization for a very longer time 
so hr is a people management and uh, a live kind of a role where it has to be there very proactive and physically no ai can uh, uh, degrade the role of hr but it can only any any automation tools can only do the automation of the entire process oriented things but the human intervention cannot be modified that's that's the reality thank you sir sir even though hr and finance are mutually exclusive after getting into an organization uh, we are going to work in either of the departments no sir so uh, how is that a problem taking this combination sir that's what see before going into finance or hr you just experiment one month in hr and one month in finance so that you get a real time experience of what it really works in real time okay because right now we are talking without any experience and uh, all the assumptions with the uh, related data but only when you undergo the reality one month you work in a manpower agency to understand how a hr works where the hiring starts and where it ends all that understand one month go to a finance company or company which gives you a finance intern and then undergo for one month and see what is the reality of finance in the company okay then you compare and understand what, what kind of characteristics will support whether you can really perform in the uh, futuristic role if at all this role can be given will i be able to perform that experience you you only have to undergo and realize which will be a right uh, perfect profile for okay for that you'll have to undergo internship for any role going for internship is the right way where we can understand the real time experience on what is the reality which is happening outside otherwise it's all just assumption and opinions where it will not take any way thank you sir understood sir what are the cost uh, how can we improve business the uh, business the uh, analytics um, um what is uh, talents sir suppose if you are if you are working in a company as a business uh, analyst and what uh, what are goals we should pursue sir first thing is you have to do a lot of networking with people people online networking offline networking all that you have to happen one is on linkedin you have to develop your profile personal branding and do an informational interview okay if you have to uh, know how a, a business analyst role can be you select a, a guy who is already in a role and do a informational interview in linkedin so that you understand what is his daily role what is his task what are the skills which is required for him to perform the role all that will help you in understanding the real, real time insights okay so pick up three different business analyst in linkedin send a connection request ask for a informational interview so that he will provide and help you with a uh, lot of information even you don't have to go externally maybe dj alumni people who will be there in linkedin those people who are in business analyst you connect with them uh, because of same college they will have a soft corner and then they will try you uh, try and give you a lot more input which is required for that too so at least three informational interview you have to do for one particular role so that you understand what skills needs to be developed for that role which will help you on taking a decision thank you so much sir yeah there is one more site called meetup.com where there are a lot of communities they meet every weekend uh, as a like minded people Uh, I think it will be there in Coimbatore also. You just check uh, meetup.com and search for MBAs or any related uh, like-minded people, where they will be publishing weekend uh, meeting programs, physical meeting programs, where they uh, have a roundtable conference on opinions, perspective, and other things. So that you go visit as a fresher and intern, and then try to talk and converse with people and understand how it works. That will help. sir so if no hr and finance what specialization go can go with finance sir other than marketing the, uh, the available option is i think it is four only in dj so hr finance marketing and operations so only with this combination you have to what is the primary one you are planning to select operations or what is it finance okay you take finance and take marketing sir if you are not interested in marketing uh, we can go with operation sir no operation requires that kind of a quality do you have that kind of quality of efficiency output process system and all that 
yes sir yes sir okay so that you have to think through one more time but you will have to equip with those kind of certifications if at all you are planning to do this kind of combination but uh, operations and finance no way it is connected it is again mutually exclusive operations is completely going into manufacturing setup and other things finance is going to more into service based consulting and all that where it may not help you in the long run because uh, people see any which way see uh, i'm talking in the little higher sense like once you cross 10 years 15 years you may not have jobs which you can aim for at a greater level because everybody cannot become a gm vp ceo and all that so after 10 years 15 years you have to start your own business you have to start your own startup okay so that point in time if you don't know the basics of marketing business development and all that it will be a great struggle i'm telling you in writing itself okay so a lot of people have to go for own business after 10 years or 15 years for which this will be a foundation for you okay there is no point in keeping a skill which is uh, which you cannot sell okay again you have to be dependable on other people but as an mba mba is something where it has a holistic it will prepare you holistic aspect you should know organization effectiveness people management finance hr these are all basic things see mba it's just just giving a idea and beginning of everything of what an organization is looking for okay it is not the ultimate thing but only if you know the foundation later point in time it will help you in developing your own business okay that way i would definitely recommend recommend even if you take a primary of hr operations or hr take second as marketing so that it will help you in a long run don't look at at a short term goals look at a longer term role where after 15 years if you have to start up your business this marketing foundation will really help okay sir so the data which i have given you just look into it multiple times and arrive at a solution don't take a very fast decision understand what is happening in reality that is why i have shown these kind of data which nobody uh, will give this kind of insights so this is not a session where i give lot of gyan or uh, what is the right choice i'm not giving a right choice i'm giving you lot of data for you to take a right decision you only have to take a right decision okay but I, what i'm showing is a reality in reality what is happening what is a where to look for a right um, information uh, with a honest uh, data and statistics that is where these three sites will help you in taking a decision but you have to contemplate and understand whether my character will support this particular role and whether i am able to perform in this role that you have to take a decision and then take a pick